in a move to support Ukraine in the fight against the Russians, Germany Defense Minister Boris Pistorius announced that the country will transfer six Sea King military helicopters to Ukraine. This event marked the first time Germany transferred military helicopters to Ukraine in the context of the Eastern European conflict. Thus, there shows no signs of cooling down. Defense Minister Pretorius emphasized that the Sea King is a proven, reliable helicopter that can support Ukraine in many roles, including reconnaissance over the Black Sea and transporting troops. Ukraine will receive six Sea King Mantaron helicopters from the reserve forces, as well as additional equipment and spare parts. These German helicopters, about 50 years old, are gradually being replaced by the NH-90 Sea Lion. The Sea King is a British military helicopter primarily used for maritime search and rescue operations. It was introduced into service in 1969 and remained active with the Royal Air Force and Royal Navy until 2018, also being used by several other countries, including Canada, Australia, India, and Belgium. Known for its reliability and versatility, the Sea King was deployed in a wide range of roles from anti submarine warfare and troop transport to search and rescue. The German version of the helicopter is the Sea King Mark 41. The German Navy placed an order for 22 Sea King Mark 41s on 20 June 1969 and have seen been the mainstay of naval aviation since the mid-1970s. In fact, the main role of the multi-purpose transport helicopter is search and rescue in German waters. Seeking Mark 41 is an improved version of the Seeking House 1, which is an anti-submarine version of the Royal Navy. The Mark 41 became the first dedicated search and rescue seeking variant with an enlarged cabin and more fuel. The German seeking had similar radar and navigation equipment to the Hus 1 but has not fitted with sonar. It is equipped with various sensors and equipment for its primary role in maritime search and rescue, including radar a forward-looking infrared camera, and a rescue hoist. It can carry up to 22 passengers, or a combination of passengers and cargo. It should be recalled that the Westland WS-61 Sea King is a British license bill version of the American Sikorsky S-61 helicopter of the same name built by Westland Helicopters. The aircraft differs considerably from the American version, with Rolls-Royce Norm engines derived from the US General Electric T-58. It was fitted British-made anti-submarine warfare systems and a fully computerized flight control system primarily designed for performing anti-submarine warfare missions. This twin-engine, single-rotor helicopter reaches a maximum speed of about 150 knots and has a maximum range of around 500 nautical miles. Powered by two Rolls-Royce Norm H1400 one turboshaft engines, H rated at 1400 horsepower, the Sea King also features an automatic flight control system for stability and navigation with a radar warning receiver, a missile approach warning system, and defensive countermeasures. Wide operating range is one of the helicopter's advantages, 
up to 1,500 kilometers. Seeking is the ideal choice for rescue operations at sea, but it is also used to transport materials and people. The helicopter typically has a crew of four, including a pilot, a co-pilot, and two crew members. The German Sea King were modernized in 1986 to 1988, gaining the ability to carry four Sea Skewer anti-ship missiles. The Sea Skewer is a British lightweight short-range air-to-surface missile designed for use from helicopters against ships. It was primarily used by the Royal Navy on the Westland links. The missile flies at high subsonic speed to a range of up to 15.5 miles. The official range is declared to be 15 kilometers, but this is widely exceeded. The missile has two sensors, a semi-active radar homing system by Markney Defense Systems and a Thompson's TRT AHV-7 radar altimeter. It is unclear whether Ukraine could receive these missiles. There are some concerns regarding the state of the Sea King helicopters in the German Navy, primarily due to their advanced age. As early as 2014, German media reports highlighted significant issues affecting these essential helicopters for naval operations. Of the 21 Sea King helicopters in service, only three were currently capable of flight representing less than 15% of the total fleet. This critical situation is mainly due to wear and tear and the obsolescence of the helicopters. First introduced to the Navy in 1975, maintaining this helicopter in operational conditions has become increasingly demanding and costly over time. In 2006, it took between 50 and 60 hours of maintenance to ensure an hour of flight, but this ratio has now dramatically increased from 1 to 120. This significant increase in maintenance time reveals the challenges associated with managing aging military equipment.